Hey guys, it is Jennifer and I have what I believe is my very last Allure Beauty Box to unbox for you guys. So without further ado, let's jump right in. All right, so I do have quite a bit of makeup on. I am getting ready to go out to a concert, believe it or not, uh, with my husband. So I'm trying to live my best concert glam right now and I'm loving it. All right, so there's a whole lot of cards in here. There used to not be like so many cards. So I'm just trying to take a glance to see what those are. All right, so I, I do believe this is my last Allure Beauty Box. At least that's what they emailed me and told me. So hopefully we will go out with a bang. All right, so the first thing is very exciting. This is a Bosha, and it looks to be a full size because it is one ounce, fluid ounce. Retails for $48. Can't beat that. And I think I was paying $13 a box when I signed up for this subscription. Um, and it says that it is a... 0.6% Pro Retinol Repair Renew Waterless Advanced Treatment. So really excited to get another retinol to try. I will use that all day. So I am really excited about that. That's a win and pretty much makes the box awesome already. The next thing is a perfect repair. It looks like this is a deluxe sample or travel size. Let me find it in the book. Yeah. So this one is one fluid ounce, but I do believe that is like a deluxe size. So because the full size, it looks like is 4.9 fluid ounces. All right, which retails for $16. And I think I did actually see this at Ulta recently. So this is a repair leave-in treatment and it says it has keratin in it, some botanical oils, and it is, it is meant to repair your hair. It says it's color safe. So I'm really excited about this. You put this on when it's wet. Yes, I think so. Yeah, because then it says then blow dry or air dry. So awesome. I'm always down to try uh, leave-in treatments. My hair is really dry in the fall and winter time. And I have some ridiculous like flyaways that I'm trying to work on right now. So I'm excited to try that. By the way, I just want to call attention real quick to this Copacetic um, Cosmetics Highlight. Ugh, it's just, it's everything right now. All right, so the next thing is, see the flyaways. I need something to tame those because they're just, they're everywhere. All right, so the next thing is by First Aid Beauty, which I really, really like, and this is a cleanser. This is 56.7 grams. I think that is the full size, which is amazing. So no, that's not true. This is two ounces, and it says for eight ounces, it retails for $34. So I think, again, this is a pretty deluxe size, though. This will last for a while. And this is just your basic cleanser. So I am really excited about that. It says it redu removes oils, makeup, dirt, impurity. So I will give it a go and let you guys know what I think. All right. So next we have the Sol de Janeiro Boom Boom Cream. Um, going to reference a video from it's Casey Wilson's channel uh, down below. She did a huge video on this recently comparing this to another item to see if it was a dupe. But in that video, she presents a lot of research about this and everything that's good and bad and all of that jam. So I'm going to link her video down below because I think it's really useful for this product. Um, but the full size retails for 45 bucks. It's very expensive. It's a great cream. Like it's pretty luxe, but let me give this a sniff. Oh, huh, it's sealed. It does smell so good. I will give them that. But here's what I'm going to say regarding the Boom Boom Cream. Um, it's good, but fortune cookie soaps, body frosting, whipped cream, even their Alleluia gel. It, to me, it, they're so much better and they're small business and they're amazing and they have wonderful customer service. So $45, as good as this smells and as luxe as it feels, I think that fortune cookie soap whipped cream, whipped cream totally puts this to shame and it's affordable and it's small business. So that's all I'm going to say about that, but I am excited to have some of that. All right, then we have a lip balm. I love a lip balm. I probably won't open this for a while. I'm hoping it's actually got a sealed thing in it. It does not, but that's okay. I'm not going to use this for a while. I'm going to put this up because I have some other lip balms I'm going through, but I mean, I love a lip balm. It's that time of year. Oh my gosh. I will use it. I will use it. I will use it. And this is in pink champagne. Ooh, is this tinted? That changes everything that I just said. Um, so this is a full full size tube by Wish Body, $20. And does it say that this is tinted? I mean, it says pink champagne. Is that just a smell? It says a soft sheen. Okay, so a soft sheen. So maybe it has a soft bit of color to it. But again, I'm not going to open it right now because I'm, I'm not ready. But I'm excited about having that. 
Okay, Allure, this box, so far we have one more item. This box has been pretty darn great. So I am so glad I get to go out on a bang. This is amazing. <gasps> and this is something I've never tried that I've always wanted to. This is a Kaja uh, Beauty Bento box. How great is this? Retails for $21. This one is in the color Chocolate Dahlia. Let's rip right into this thing. Oh, I'm so excited. I have wanted to try these for ages. Oh, it's so cute. It's so cute. Oh, and it's giving me all the neutral. I'll tell you what it reminds me of. These neutrals are just reminding me of Laura Lee's Nudie Patootie Clothesline. If you're not familiar with that, she has so many things in these colors. All right. I'm really excited about this. So it looks like you get this gorgeous shimmer. I'll come back to that. What else? Oh, whew. This little paper disc threw out, flew out. I thought for sure that my eyeshadow was broken and I was gonna cry. But you get this awesome uh, transition-y color for me, matte. Might be a little light for some. And then you get, that one did scratch that. I don't know why we need those, but then we get a darker matte brown. So let me swatch these real quick. Oh my gosh, I am so excited. Do they each have a color? I don't think so. I think it's just Chocolate Dahlia. I've never felt these. I have no idea. Ooh, ooh, it's soft. It is soft and that is pigmented. Okay, okay. That could have kept on going. I mean, it doesn't even seem that much has gone away. I'm gonna just blend that out a bit. That's, that's incredible. That is pigmented. That's amazing. Oh, I don't need to fall in love with another eyeshadow brand right now. I'm really trying to like rein myself in these days. All right. So here is the, that's a little light. So I'm going to do that again. This is the lighter matte. Okay. 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 I'm going to just go for a second swipe on that. You can definitely build, you can definitely build that up as well. So I know these swatches are all over the place, but this is kind of tiny. All right, and let's see this shimmer. I know that's what me and you and we're all waiting for. So it is this gorgeous sort of pinky rose gold. Okay, this is not as soft as the mattes, the shimmer. It's not a soft shimmer. So far, I think the mattes are winning, but here is where we'll know for sure. I'm running out of space for swatching. I mean, it swatches beautifully, absolutely beautifully. It's a bit chunky, but nothing, I mean, if you would saturate your brush before using that, look what a gorgeous look that is. Oh, this is a great Allure Beauty box. And the reason I'm like so exasperated right then is because I don't need to become obsessed with any more eyeshadows or formulas. I mean, I'm, I'm getting out of control here. All right, so that's it for me, guys. I think this is an incredible box. I'd love to know what you think in the comments down below. Hope everybody's doing great, and I'll see you guys in my next one. Bye.